Hello, Christians. This is Kamala, Portland, Oregon, Christian-based grandma here. Going to get this truth out there. I'm already a target. Just waiting on the Lord. That I am. Anyway, my dad told me something always. If you want an answer about the truth, follow the money. Follow the money. So the U.S. sent $6 billion in funds in a prisoner swap to Iran. We have that. They're saying not a penny was spent in the Hamas attack. No, maybe not. They might have borrowed against it. They didn't have to spend it. They could borrow against it. It was their money in the first place. So there we go. That argument settled. Secondly, we have this, that the U.S. trained special forces in the West Bank to operate in the West Bank. They were actually trained in Georgian, Jordan, 5,000 troops trained by the U.S. to operate in the West Bank. Figure that one out. Hezbollah recruits trained to be West Bank Hamas. There you go. Look at the date, March of this year. This has been going on for a while, this plan. Somebody made another deal with the devil. Now, this is something that I didn't know. What a coincidence. A, a little less than a month before the attack, the Palestinians received U.S. vehicles and weapons through Jordan. I bet that's where they got those paragliders. That one just has me just bedazzled with what? Paragliding in onto a music, music festival and slaughtering innocent people? savages. I'm just going to throw it out there. Some people are just friggin' the seed of the devil. And a person that could slaughter innocents like that is Satan's seed. So I don't really have a problem with Israel wiping out every single one of them. And I said it. I don't like any killing, but the killers have to be stopped some way or another. So be it. The peace of God to you all.